Hi, welcome to our channel. I'm Bill, and this is Lori over here to the, my left. Uh, recently, within the last week, we purchased an Uni Coda 16 pizza oven, and tonight we're going to use it to cook a steak on the Grizzler uh, plate, which is an accessory you can buy uh, from uh, Uni. And so the process has been, we've had this turned on high for about uh, 10 minutes. So we're getting that plate uh, hot. Uh, this oven will go up to 900 uh, or better degrees Fahrenheit. And, uh, and so kind of here's the process. Lori's gonna take the plate out and uh, then we're gonna cook a steak. And notice the uni gloves. Uh, Okay, so the uh, Grizzler plate comes with a little uh, wooden uh, standoff, so you can put it down on that. And then we're gonna put the steak on. All right. And then back into the oven it goes. Yeah. Okay, you got your timer going? So, this might be a 90 second cook. Um, but this is kind of trial and error. This is the first steak we've done in our, uh, in our oven. And the steak is a little bit thicker uh, normally, uh, a 20 millimeter steak, 0.78 inches. This one here, uh, is about an inch, but they say you can cook a steak in 90 seconds. On one side. Oh, on one side? Oh, and then you got to do the other? Okay. So, I'll just show you a little bit about this oven. Uh, this one here is a propane powered oven. And here we have the regulator. Um, and in its current position, that is uh, full flame, so for maximum heat. Oops. Fire is coming out. Whoa, maybe we can turn it down. You want me to turn it down? Okay, so. we're gonna, now we're gonna put it to its lower setting. Okay, we've turned it down. Wow, the flame's really shooting out the front. I think I'm going to take it out. Okay, just make sure you have it securely in there. All right, we're going to take it out. Wow. Okay. All right. Mind me to get a fire extinguisher. Okay, you got to put it back in? No, I'm going to wait for the time to go. Okay. Maybe we don't need the need to put it back in. Okay. Can you move it a little bit away from the side of the uni, though? You know what I mean? Just a little bit. That's good. Okay, definitely, I guess we got a ribeye, huh? Yeah. A steak should be 135 to 145, but if you're gonna let it rest, you should be like five to 10 degrees lower for medium rare. No, it's not pretty. It's not even close. Yeah, not even close. Okay. Well, I hope you're enjoying the video. As you see, we had some flare-ups. So at this point, I put the camera down. I was hand-holding so I could help Lori if she needed assistance. Um, 
We were able to put the steak back in, put it in for about 90 seconds, probably 30 seconds too long, uh, but that's okay. And you'll see when she's slicing uh, that she mentions that maybe it was overcooked. Actually, when we gave it a closer inspection, and I'll have a still of a slice of the beef, it really turned out just fine. So, back to the video. Okay, well, we kind of recovered from the flare-up. I We weren't ready for the... Uh, the amount of fat on the uh, grizzler plate. So again, this is a learning process, uh, a little bit of trial and error, learn as we go, share uh, what we learned. And uh, we're just kind of letting this rest right now. And uh, in a few minutes, we'll, we'll slice it and see what it looks like. And uh, just to show you, there's still a fair amount of uh, fat on this plate so I guess we weren't quite ready for that maybe it's uh, the cut of the meat being a ribeye it's got a lot of marbling so um, but these are things that will work and uh, perfect the moment of truth Lori's gonna slice it up so I can see it I'm a little bit overdone okay overdone okay well uh, steak number one will work out the kinks and um, thanks for watching strong in retirement Uni <laughs> coda 16 <laughs> episodes just a couple of quick thoughts in closing the steak was superb the char was out of this world one of the best tasting steaks I've had in a long time. Yep, we had a little bit of flare-up. We'll be better prepared. We have two more ribeyes to cook. We'll capture that for you and share it with you. So, really in love with this Uni Coda 16 oven and the Grizzler platter. I really don't see us using our regular old barbecue anymore. Uh, I encourage you, try a steak. Get the platter, try a steak. I think you'll be fine. Uh, next uh, ribeye that we do, we'll keep everything low heat. We'll be prepared for some flare-up. Uh, but boy, was it a fantastic uh, tasting steak. Um, and we're just having a ball with our uh, Uni Coda 16 outdoor pizza oven. The versatility of it, uh, we've cooked halibut on it, we've cooked chicken wings on it, uh, we've cooked a steak, and of course, we've cooked six pizzas so far, and we're just having a blast. So thanks for stopping in at the channel. Hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, feel free to leave any comments or questions uh, below uh, and we'll be happy to respond. Thanks.